Hey everyone. I'm so weird. Happy New Year. Um, yeah, it's been over a year since I've done anything on this channel, but welcome back. My name is Raven, um, Raven of DIY Raven. And I mean, I've been sewing. I've been living. I've been quarantining. <laughs> Um, so I guess to start, I'll just show you kind of what I'm working with, the disaster area that is my sewing room. But hey, I'm lucky and very thankful to have a sewing room. But here we go. This is the main door you come into. Um, and then this is my, basically my, my work desk. So work related things for the most part. Um, some Ankara fabric or African wax print fabric that I got from New York that actually, um, what happened? Oh, I used it as, it's like three yards of it. I used it as a covering for the Thanksgiving table. <laughs> so I need to wash it. I used that to cover the table for Christmas, not for Thanksgiving. Not that trifling. Um, I never used this, but I always felt that I could use it. See, look at that. 2018. That's terrible. I made the burn house bibs like almost a long time ago. Okay, anyway, so this is where a lot of my... Okay, that's great. Um, a lot of my fabric and notion stuff live but it's it's a hot mess it's overflowing i'm gonna have to work on this area this is a just a camera thing you clamp that on the table you can put your your my phone is my camera so i, I attach it there so you can have like a steady camera uh that is soil yeah um the jacket that I made not long ago that I still need to post about. Um, I have all of my, a lot of my sewing stuff just along the windowsill, some plants that I have neglected, another plant I have neglected. I, I love, let me back up if I can. I love that bookcase, probably my best purchase of last year. My Juki sewing machine was my best purchase of last year. Uh, oh, in the middle of the room is my like project table, which I have like my main sewing machine on and I'm watching a sewing related YouTube video right now, <laughs> actually about room organization. Um, more fabric, um, my poor other sewing machines that, um, are on the floor actually my iron is on the floor right now and that's because sometimes I work from home right here and the iron will be in the shop okay so what I meant was I work from home at the, usually at the corner of this table actually not at that table which is I know it's kind of weird but it's like I can see the window and I get good lighting so my Zoom calls are from this corner. And if I have the iron here, I don't know, it just looks a little weird in the shot. Anyway, go on, go on. That's studio lighting, not opening those closets. It's actually not too bad in there. This is like literally just in case you were curious because I know if I were looking at this video, I would be so. This is the box for my new sewing machine, printer, my serger. Um, these are some patterns I think I plan to either keep or sell. I forgot, and some patterns in here. Maybe, I'll, maybe I'm keeping these and trying to sell those, anyway. And, you know, just some things that I've made and some patterns. Yeah, I know there's fabric up there too. Oh, this is a mood bag. And this is a lonely pattern 
for leggings, but then I actually just made my own leggings pattern, so I still need to try that out. But yeah, that is the basics of my room. It is a, look at this angle. This is just such a hot mess, but you know, like things aren't pretty. <laughs> this is where I'm at. Um, but I really want to get more organized and I think I'm going to start with my fabric stash back there. Um, but yeah. Okay, so I think that's enough. You know, it's just the first day of the year, so I don't want to overwhelm anybody. I'm not trying to make this a long video. It's been a while, so I just wanted to come on and really say hey, kind of show you where where I'm at. I'm not perfect, so it's not really cute right now. But yeah, mostly I think what I'm gonna try to focus on is my fabric stash situation because it's just out of control right now. And we really like to like carefully sift through like a lot of my notions and, and such. What happens is I either buy duplicates of things because I don't realize I already have it, or I just know that I already have something in my stash and then by the time I'm ready to do said project, that stash is nowhere to be found because I didn't have it. Anyway, details, details. It's good to be back. Just wanted to say hey, check in with everybody. Hope your first day of the new year is going well. So I'm gonna leave you on that note and happy sewing and happy new year. Bye. <laughs>